Hey YouTubers, Sign543 in the house. Anyway, I have a couple of questions I want to ask you. I was in a debate forum today talking about rights like the right to life, right to, you know, things like speech. Do you believe as Americans that we have a right to food and a right to health care? And what do you think a right is? Put it down in your comment. You see, my definition of a right is your sovereignty to act or pursue or go forth without any permission from anybody else. I believe that we have a right to have access to food and access to affordable quality health care. I don't think health care in and of itself or food is an inherent right. I think that if anything you do requires the property, the money, the belongings, or the help of anybody else, that's not really a right. It's a service or a privilege. But nobody is obligated to give it to you for free. And the same with health care. Being a liberal, I've gotten a lot of slack from my friends on this position because they believe that universal health care is a right of every human being. In fact, that was adopted by the United Nations. Basic human right is you have a right to food and to health care. I disagree. I don't think we have a right to food. I think we have a right to have access to food. That's different. But you have to earn it or buy it or grow it or bargain for it from your own ability and strength. Now, of course, we have charities that help people who can't help themselves, but I don't think we should be forced to help anybody else. Is that wrong? Okay, I would talk more, but I am going to the store to buy Pat Conroy's new book. If you don't know who Pat Conroy is, I will put it in the description with a link. He's a brilliant author. My favorite book of all time is his book, The Prince of Tides, which was made into a movie starring Barbara Streisand, but it doesn't compare to the book at all. The book is fantastic. Anyway, talk to you later. Are you still here? Scoot! <laughs>